Why is it not letting me pick this game? So, there we go. Game, why are you like this? Sorry, the game and me. There we go. One second, just... Oh, why isn't it updating? Damn you. Huzzah, there we go. Okay, now we can get to these ghosts. Hey, Jared, how are you? So, this is weird because I'm only hearing out of one side of my headset. No, it's all the way up. It's just me. Hey, hi, Jaded Bot. Well, this is, uh, I'm wireless right now. Hey, Beliefs, thank you for the sub, and thank you for the five months in a row. Can I get some love and hype in the chat? Ah, uh, fuck. I did that on the fly, and I shouldn't have. Yeah, it's um it's my hearing. <laughs> Sorry. How is that? I I switched USB slots. Um can I get resub hype in the chat please for beliefs? Thank you. Is that better? Um yeah, I basically hot swapped the where it was plugged in. Hey, I see you lurking. How are you? Okay, so for those that have not seen this before, um, it is a game about dating ghosts. You are a ghost, and you're trying to date other ghosts. I've done a bit of this, and, um, so this is not a brand new game. If people want me to start a brand new game, I can do that. Uh, but I have not finished a whole, um, playthrough. And you just went right into those puns yourself, Jared. Can I get a shout out for Jared as well, and Art for the Apocalypse? Oh wait, have, have I? Oh well, shit! I dated all the ghosts. I think. Oh god. I may have one ghost left, so you may get a brand new game. 
So I finished the other two rooms. Oh, I've already dated Gary. Then who's left? <coughs> oh, Drea. Woof. Did Brian get a shout out? Uh, can some, I don't remember. So this is the last date I have op open, so I'll actually restart the game after I've dated Andrea. Or Andrea, not Andrea. I'm thinking of Andrea. Um. So full disclosure, I was one of the beta testers for the game. I have played this a lot. Um. <laughs> I think Andrea would have a word to say about that. Um. Yeah, I couldn't remember because I'm tired. Um, so, full disclosure, Drea was like one of my least favorite dates, and I'm still not sure how this is going to play out. I'm going to make different choices. But she reminded me a lot of Sarah, and I didn't like Sarah in Inquisition because of how uh, pranky she was. But Drea also has they, them pronouns, so I have to remember that. Um, and because Drea and Keo have they, them pronouns. <laughs> yes, I'm surprised. Um, so yeah, so Dre is the one character that was one of the two characters I really wasn't feeling, and it's again, it's more my personality and how they would have been as alive people. But we meet them as ghosts. I mean, this I can relate to. I can see why Dre will be mad about people just drinking coffee and doing yoga. As in gentrification has taken over where they used to live when they were alive. Um, I'm not going to do voices. I'm not good at voices regardless, even if my voice was not shot. Um... Because after four days at a convention, I'm glad I can talk. This is probably the most sterile apartment I can think of right now. Like, Dre seems really bothered that these people have cleaners. Oh my god. Where's this pun going? Wow, we start dating ghosts and suddenly tentacles everywhere. So I know there's a secret date, but I have not managed it yet. My chat, y'all. My chat. <laughs> Evil Ghoul Veil. Sure. I do love you all. I'm just like shaking my head. Coffee, you can get the game on Steam or on itch.io. 
Um, I have it from Itch. So if you look up Speed Dating for Ghosts or Copy Chaser Games, uh, which is, I tagged them in my tweet about going live. Um, or if someone can grab a link to both Steam and to... Actually, do I still have my command for Speed Dating? Um, someone type exclamation booze, B-O-O-S. It may work, it may not. I don't remember if I still have it turned on. Alright, feel better, base. Okay, there it is there. Haha. -ha. Um, why is it trying to not let you do links? You should be on there as a regular and a sub, and that should work. Can someone permit a coffee frame for a link, please? I try to be base. Okay, that's weird though. Well, um, can someone permit coffee frame? <laughs> so I think there's a cooldown on the booze command. Link away, uh, coffee. I didn't go in the kitchen last time I did this. I went in the bedroom. Okay. And this is why I won't have a smart appliance in my house. They're yuppies. Hey, Corsair. Thank you for the subscription. Welcome to Team Cypher. How are you? Can I get love in the chat for Corsair's subscription, please? Subhype. There should be an exclamation subhype command that works. How are you, Corsair? And I'm picking this because I have a grudge against Kale. Like an actual grudge against Kale. Fuck Kale. Like Kale and Cleanse is like... All the hype. Oh my god, why would you put frogs in the refrigerator? <laughs> Fuck Kale. Uh, won't that hurt the frogs, though? And eh, fuck Kale. <laughs> Socks. Oh my god. <laughs> it's more what Kale stands for than actual Kale, Brian. I'm sure Kale unto itself is, is actually decent. And I have had uh, kale chips that were decent. Um, but overall, I'm just... Wow, socks. You have to tweet that one. You have to totally tweet that or clip it. But I'm just, I'm more worried about the frogs. Oh, is ghastly. <laughs> oh, my canthrope. Oh, my canthrope. It, it's a green leafy vegetable? I mean, Tom is... Oh. Hey, Catchin, how are you? Come to see me uh, get that that ghostly lovin'. You're in time for the, the last date I have open, and I'm actually going to restart. 
So I don't know. Um, <laughs> Catchin is IRL friend. Uh, that could happen, Trom. I mean, I do have a bunch of beer that Lining Kugel sent me. Um, so booze, haha. Oh my god, I have plenty of booze. I have probably too much booze right now. Um, <sighs> someone tweet about the punnery in this in this chat because I. I am outdone. So I didn't like Dr wait, Drea likes me? I I am surprised. <laughs> wow, you got all caps. You got all caps. This is what happens when we're silly and I'm gone for a while. Wow, 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 wow. They are bourgeoisie. <laughs> you knew what was gonna happen. You knew what was gonna happen. A nice night for a haunting. A nice, okay. So I've dated everyone now. Now let's see what happens when I try to talk to Fran. I'm back. Oh, I get stats. I'm trying to figure out why Fran's like this. Is she a deer that got hit by a car? Wow, wow, wow. Wow, y'all. I feel like I need alcohol to deal with this chat. I, I, I've been trying to figure out all this time if she's a deer because her head's tilted like this and she's got antlers. But I feel like I need alcohol to deal with the puns in the chat. Hey, Pseudo. Not even alcohol turn up because I drank a little too much of Pax. Well... That means just Socks is really getting in the spirit of things, Trom. I don't know, Chloroplast, and it's bothering me. Damn it, Socks had a better pun. Cremation's pretty permanent and there wouldn't be much of an afterlife. Oh, I never thought of that catching. Huh. Brian, you're a little late. I want to know the meaning of life. <laughs> I guess so? Like, I've, I literally keep doing this because it's bothering me. Oh, alright. We'll play trivia. I'm bad at trivia. Alright, before I do the trivia, I'm going to actually go get a beer. I will BRB.
host? Sam, thank you for the host. How are you? Oh, Brian. Hey, Sam. Can I get a shout out for Sam, who's also uh, start streaming on I Need Diverse Games on Wednesdays? So, uh, Sam's really, really awesome. Wow, all the puns. Sam, I hope you like puns. That's what's been happening here. All of the puns. Oh no, Fran has scary heart trivia. What will I do? Sorry, I'm looking for... I'm looking for a thing. Hold on. Sorry, I was looking for my fingerless, like, gloves, and I can't find them, and Genki's, like, in the way. Oh, there they are. Because it's just chilly enough to where I want them. I am okay. I am just back from PAX today. I can hear, mostly. Um, oh my god, Trom, where are you going with this? Trom. I, I don't know what I'm going to do here. Because you all are like... Um, Pax was good. I paced myself. It was frustrating because of the ear thing, and I felt kind of useless on the first couple of panels I was on, because I couldn't hear very well. Um, but I just took my time. <laughs> oh shit, I should know this. Is it Grace Kelly or Marilyn Monroe? Because Marilyn Monroe died in a car crash. Um, I'm going to go... With, I want to say Grace Kelly. I don't think it's Cary Grant. Because Marilyn Monroe died in a terrible car accident. I'm going to go with Grace Kelly. Unless someone else in the chat knows better. Because um, I don't know... my uh, celebrity trivia that way. I'm going with Grace Kelly. Last chance for the chat to say so. I thought it was Monroe that died in a car crash. I could be wrong. Then, okay. I'm going with Grace Kelly. Oh, it was not Grace Kelly. Oh shit, I should have said Marilyn Monroe. Okay. You're right, it was Marilyn Monroe. Oh, it was Mansfield that died in the car crash. Which Shakespearean king appears as a ghost in a play that shares his name? I got this wrong last time and that bothered me. I want to say it's Richard III because Richard II is who dies. Okay. Wow, Trom is on a roll. This better be right catching. Damn it. God damn it. Well, oh shit, I got a donation. I didn't even see it. Uh, hold on a second. Let me look and see who that was. Um, I got a donation and I it didn't pop up. Hold on. Ha ha, donations. And I'm not logged in. One second. Uh, 
Um, alerts. Um, dashboard. Who did that? Aw, Diddlin, thank you for the donation. I'm sorry it did not pop up because I don't have a Streamlabs set up right. Bye, Coffee Frame. So thank you, Diddlin, for the, that donation. Night, Coffee Frame. Thank you for hanging out so long. Helmet's father appears as a ghost. His name was also technically Hamlet. Which I should know because I was a Shakespeare nerd in high school. God damn it. So once we get through the trivia, I'll start a new game and you can see how it goes from the beginning. Feel Shakespeare, man. This one I got wrong because I have no idea and I don't know. Trom, are you still in the chat? You're the nurse. Hopefully Trom is still here because uh, this was a nurse question. Because I want to say Revenant. I don't think that's right though. Um, I'm not googling it by the way. <laughs> Trom, do you know the answer to this one? Because I have no idea and I know I got it wrong last time. <laughs> you don't know this one? Shit. I'm gonna go with Phantom because Ghost seems too obvious. Son of a biscuit! I'm, I'm 0 for 4 right now, so... <clears throat> During her seances, what did medium Helen Duncan famously regurgitate and call ectoplasm? Uh... Mm. That would make sense, Jared? Uh, I think this one was cheesecloth. Too many ghost puns. What happened? Why did it do that? Sorry, Chloroplast. That was the only one I got right on a guess last time. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, really? I did not know that. Huh. Well, I'm one for four. Oh, like these others haven't been hard. Oh fuck, I messed this up. Which of these authors did not have a story in the first volume of the Fontana Book of Great Ghost Stories? I want to say it's Edgar Allan Poe. Well, I haven't answered this one yet, Catchin. So I could be two for five. Because I think I guessed D.H. Lawrence last time. And I was totally wrong. And I don't know who Algernon Blackwood even is. I'm going to go with Poe. So I'm two for five. I guess... This, most of this is shit I would never have a reason to know, but... The Rocking Horse Winner, which I'd never heard of either. I don't know.
ghost keeping. So we're going to erase date data and start entirely over. I've never read it. That took me off guard the first time it happened. I'm a ghost. Why do I need to pay to go to on vacation to hell? I don't want to go down the river sticks. A hologram. No. All right, so that was the one date at trivia I had left. So we're going to erase data and start over. Oh, wait. God. <laughs> I'm just one Fran. I guess there's always fanfic. People have been writing fanfic for this. Someone Google speed dating for ghost fanfic. I want to see what comes up. Fanfic. Okay, that one. That that's a good one. That is a good one. You don't have to share every link. Oh my god. I thought someone has shared art with, with uh, Ben and Copy Chaser. <laughs> I'm surprised. Phantom fic. Goodbye, save data. All right, so now we have a fresh new game. We're going to start over and pick a couple different options. We'll, we'll date one ghost per room, mostly because I've been on much longer than I expected. And uh, I did travel today. So, yeah. Can someone do exclamation uptime? Anyone should be able to do it. So Fran again. Oh my god, it's only been two hours. It feels like it's been longer. I don't know why this feels like it's been a super long stream. I guess we'll play more speed dating for ghosts. And I loved once Celesme played this because she was just so into it. The pun ishment. I can't be mean to Fran though. Like I literally am incapable of being mean to Fran. Alright, bye Brian. Thank you. Oh my god, this chat though. I'm telling on all of you. I was like, if you like ghost puns, come to this chat. Um, then you should haunt this new game. 
I've started. That's not a word. That's not a word either. I mean, it is a word, it's not the right word. Trying to type on my phone is apparently very hard for me today. Oh, Brian. I don't know what to do with you all. I really don't know what to do with all of you. Sam, I'll see if I can get you a copy for I Need Diverse Games. Um, if you want to play it there. I do love us. Please don't die, Pseudo. <laughs> You're not hurting my feelings. I'm like... I just... I don't have a good comeback. Really, I don't. Um, I don't have a good comeback for these. I'm not that funny on a good day and I'm tired. Um, I'm just like... I'm just, I have no comeback to these. That's that's my biggest problem. I'm not that funny on a good day. And you all are moving way too fast with the punnery for me. <laughs> yeah. Abundant. Abundant. I... I got nothing. <laughs> One second. <laughs> One second. I'm basically telling on you all to the internet. That's what I'm doing. It is. You are, you are really, really, I, I <laughs> the internet loves us too. I, I wish Nora was here catching. I don't know like if she would yell at us or love it. Um And me knowing about Atome games is your fault, by the way. You and Donna. You are not innocent. Uh, you are the worst punnery, excuse me, Trom. Blame Shayna, okay. Why isn't Shayna in the chat? She should be here. I see you with that fake ass halo socks. I also want more chocolate, but I don't know how well chocolate goes with this beer.
Well, she can just lurk. She doesn't have to talk in the chat. Um, it is Barry Weiss by Lenny Kugel, one of the many bottles of beer they sent me. Um, I'm serious, I had a 32 pound box of beer on my front steps when I got back from Seattle. Um, I've got non perials I've also got, um, uh, cashew, milk chocolate covered cashews with salt. Yes. It was a lot of bottles of beer and one six pack, or I'm sorry, 12 pack sampler of all of their shandies. Oh, there's a pomegranate shandy I want to try. Apparently, Lottie Kugel likes it when you say you like their beer on Twitter because they were like, hey, you want some beer? And I was like, sure. I didn't expect a 32 pound box of beer. Hey, Violet Rosemary, how are you? So, yes, while the stream is definitely not sponsored by anyone, um, alco by alcohol, thanks, Lottie Kugel. Yeah, I got it, and then I couldn't enjoy it because I literally left two days later. Um, it was good, Rosemary. Um, I paced myself, and that's what I've been saying a lot, is like, I didn't try to do everything. Um, I just... Um, I did my panels, was at the table in, in good... You know, in, in spurts. Because I have to do meetings and my panel schedule's weird. Yes, brought to you by the spirits. Oh no, Keo, baby ghost. A ghost! Um, Keo, you're a ghost. Keo also has they them pronouns. Um, Akio, you're, you're a ghost too. This is cracking me up because I'm like, you're a ghost. Why, why are you afraid of me? And now that I've said... God damn it, cat. Genki almost got stepped on. Because I literally turned around and it was like, suddenly, a cat... So, fresh from the Ghirardelli store in Boston. Not poor Genki, he's like curled up under my feet. He almost got stepped on. Mmm. Actually, this pairs well with the lining kugel. Because it has salt. Yeah, the, we went to the Ghirardelli store and had ice cream. Me having ice cream was not my best idea, but I did it anyway. I'm not scary, Keo. I'm a friendly ghost, which sounds really strange. Well, you're a ghost too. And so, just so you know, the, the way ghosts look, some of it is tied to how they died, some of it is tied to how they lived. And as we date Gio, you will you will see this. Um, and again, if the crunching noise we drinking or eating is loud or mis or causes any mis misphonia, please let me know. And I can move the mic or just not nibble while I'm streaming. <laughs> yeah, uh, found a Ghirardelli thanks to uh, Taylor and Alan. And thank you. I can't, I can never remember that word. A book or an incomplete chat message. Like, it'll just be a forever blinking cursor. 
Okay, I've started eating this. This may be a bad idea. So if you're alive, no, this isn't the first, this isn't the deepest date. Hey Sam, can you DM me on Twitter and let me know if you prefer itch.io or a Steam link? Because we can just buy you the game if you're going to stream it. Yep, the ghosts were there. Uh, I won't tell you which ghost, but there is a ghost who doesn't realize they're a ghost. And that gets a little philosophical. There's one that gets super philosophical. Um, and you're just like, how do we get here? And you realize how you got there as you don't go through the date. I just like, I want to protect Kyo. I like, I want to protect Kyo to, to hold them and like, you're, you're a sweet little muffin. I am making different changes or different choices. Hmm. This is a new choice. Uh, can someone who's a mod throw out a shout out for INDG? Which is not partnered. Um, I'm gonna wind up eating this whole bag, aren't I? I can't hear him. Genki. Genki, what are you doing? Oh, poor Kyo. As for those that may not have seen the news, I Need Diverse Games channel is uh, partnered as of April 3rd. Oh, poor Kyo. I think the next stream will be Sam's as well. Are you still playing um, Hellblade, Sam? Hey, nothing, only me. I am having fun romancing ghosts. I've romanced the ghosts before. Um, and I'm taking different choices. How have you been feeling? I saw you weren't feeling so hot the other day. <laughs> so the way it works, you have to go through the first, like, speed date, and then you pick dates... You pick which ghost you want to date of the three, and as long as there are ghosts left to date, you can always go back. But once you do all the dates, the room will come up empty, like we saw earlier. Hey, Kimba, how are you? You're in time for uh, me getting these this ghost loving on. Um, so I'm going to go through each room, and then we'll pick a ghost for me to do one date with before I call the stream. Kind of reminds me of mid 2000s emo band Armor for Sleep. <coughs> oh no. Oh, that's fine, Jared. I didn't realize you were on a tablet because I normally can't chat when I'm on my phone very well or a tablet. Um, and if you want me to read out the text, I can. It's just my voice is a little shot after four days at a con. So. Voices are off the table, but I can try to read it a bit if you'd like. All right, let me not eat all of the... Um, cashews. Mm -hmm. 
see, Peter, something about Peter rubs me the wrong way. And I can't quite put my finger on what it is. Oh, that sucks. Well, and it's like, I didn't think that my voice would, was that affected. Well, it's not just the fedora. You'll see that it's things um, that he says. Now, I'm picking different stuff. Because last time, I was very anti everything he would want. I wound up making choices on the date that worked out. But, like, this part. Um, I basically was like, I'm not scared of you. <laughs> kind of pseudo. But he's supposed to, like, have died during the Black Death and the Black Plague. This is the Black Death. That's why your font is old, you bastard. I'm so sorry, y'all. Alright, bye, socks. I'm glad I'm back to you. There will be the usual stream at some point tomorrow. Yeah, he's like a plague doctor. Sleep well, socks. Like I said, I'm gonna go through and do like the dates, at least the room, um, and then call it because it's only nine for me, but it feels later. Oh my god. And if you listen to the music and kind of the cadence of things, possibly nothing, only me. My very first playthrough, but uh, just keep, for me, I was a beta tester for the game. So it did put me off of the character. There, are, Like there's been one character per room that you can date where I'm like, eh, I'm not sure how I feel about this. Um, like, Drea in the last room, the room of black, is that character for me. Um, Peter is reminding me of um, bro dudes who have to be right and try to impress you on a date. And that's what I'm taking from him right now, even though I know that's not the case. And it's like, look at me, aren't I awesome? He really wants a protege, that's what he wants. I'm being very conciliatory and nice toward Peter this time, because normally I'm like, man, fuck you, and teaching me to be a spook. Which, spook is a slur, depending on how... on the context. Um... I would hear that and kind of freak out, and I'd remember, oh, it's literally ghosts. I'm talking about ghosts, it's okay. Yeah, like, there's been a, a character per room that I have been like, eh, don't like you. Huh. No matter what you pick, he's going to criticize it, so it doesn't matter. What do you mean, nothing, only me? How do you mean to read into the character? I'm just curious. And like I said, I could I could read out some stuff, or you all can read it yourself. Uh, but just voice acting ain't gonna happen. Hmm. 
Really? Do you want to elaborate, Trom? I mean, Peter's right. Um, that's why I've kind of got away from horror films. Like, the stuff that I grew up with is not... It's, like, cheesy compared to some of the stuff they do now. Like, a lot of stuff now is basically just as much gore and violence as they can cram into a movie. But, like, when, when I was a kid... Um, there was a lot of uh, nuance to horror. It was um, tell, and it was show to a degree. Mm, I got you, nothing, I got you. Like, what was the movie um, Signs? I love Signs because everything was hinted at. And, like, one of the scenes that got to me was one of the camera of... This will be what happens when aliens show up. Um, oh god, the, the, the loan shark, literally. Like, why are you asking me about money? Why? You're a ghost. And there's a scene in Signs where they're hiding in an apartment and there's just enough light under the door to see the movement. I never played Undertale, so I don't... Um, oh, it gets better, Catchin. Just wait. Shark Bro is like every pushy bro that tried to, like, let me hold a hundred bucks. You're a shark. <laughs> okay, do ghosts even need money? It's always my, your ghost. What are we going to spend money on? Uh, but like, there's a scene and it's just like the flickering threat of what could open that door at any time freaked me the fuck out. Like, I understood why they were in closets with tinfoil on after that scene. Well, we're ghosts, so why are we trying to, like, get money? There could be ghost capital capitalism. Blair Witch, I was one of the people that couldn't watch it, though. It made me motion sick. I've never watched Cloverfield. Um, I was, I literally had to leave the theater trying to watch Blair Witch. I still have not seen it all the way through. Because that shaky cam thing. Mm. No, thank you. This is what I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> Date over. I did actually push him away. No, Blair Witch is the prototypical shaky cam. It's actually like... For that generation, kind of the other one. I I was like, this this is too much. Um, and I never saw Cloverfield. Are they by the same people? I'm sure it is beautiful, but the shaky cam messed with me. I couldn't do it. I'm going to judge you. So, are we judging shark? Oh, okay. So, are we are we asking the stupid question of you rob banks? Uh, is it nice to meet Leon? Or I'm not interested. Because I can cut the date real short. Um, well, there's I'm not interested, nice to meet you, and you rob banks.
I'm just shaking my head at you, Trom. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Yes. Oh, God. <laughs> you know what, Trom? You should tweet this. And be like, why does a ghost need money? I'm sure that Ben would probably answer if he's not lurking. Oh my god, you and this robbing a bank. How are you, Akimba? Oh my god, you're trying to rob banks, you fuck. I want to, like, go in the Discord. Oh my god, that would be such a good question. Like, this has sparked a whole ghost economy question. Okay, hold on. I have to tweet this. Because this is hilarious and funny. I know I'm stopping play... Boo coin. Someone like just screenshot the chat, Jesus. Oh my god. I don't know what to do with you. I'm 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 throwing out a tweet. Hey, hydrated bot. I should have had 12 ounces of water, which I have not had. And I live alone, and I don't want to go get water. Um. Um. I'm throwing out a tweet. Which means I'm going to have 8 million uh, bots in my mentions after I tweet this. Is there a universal currency for ghosts? Poor Keo, and this is why I want to protect poor little Keo. And I cannot be mean to Keo. There is an achievement if you if you mess up every single date. I will never get it. I'm just still like y'all are having this discussion about the fucking ghost economy. <laughs> I knew. We should actually have this discussion in Discord. Someone throw the link to Discord in. Just I think you have to be a regular or a subscriber at least. Are there any mods in the chat? Um. Sorry, since I'm here.
I'm just here like how do we get here how do we get to talking about Bitcoin and ghosts what is my life True, but the ghosts are clearly not equal. I mean, Peter has a hierarchy because he's an old ghost. I mean... So socialist ghosts or capitalist ghosts? I think it's, I know what's going to happen with all the ghosts, but I am trying to pick different objectives. I mean, Leon's trying to rob a fucking bank, and I know what happens when he robs the bank and it goes badly. Um, so for the sake of people who don't know what's going to happen, I will not spoil you. But you can really, really fuck up the, the date, aka the bank robbery with Leon, and the one human could suffer. Not in a way that you're thinking. Ghosts don't have need, at least not a physical need. Um, because honestly, if if a ghost had money, what would it do with it? Um. Because you're eternal when you're a ghost, so what do you do at that point? The ghost Letariat needs to rise up and overthrow the bourgeois. Okay, someone needs to tweet that. Oh my god. Or make a... Oh, Socks went to bed. Damn it. This is too much. This is too much. These fucking puns. For heck's sake. Ugh. I'm like just trying to get laid as a ghost, I guess? But, well, not even get laid, it's like just find someone to hang out with. It's fine, nothing, it's totally fine. We're gonna get through the, the three dates and I'll probably call it because I'm getting a little tired. Um, wait, what's wrong, Trom? Y you sound surprised as much as you can sound surprised in a text chat <clears throat> so say you hook up and tie the knot how do you marry to eternity since there is no till death i mean if you get married as a ghost it sounds like it's pretty serious um Yes, that is a mod sword, Trom. You have the power. I was waiting for you to notice. One second. I mean, eternity is a lot. Oh, poor 
Kyo. That was not the right one, I think. Is there some kind of ghost government that handles marriage licenses and paperwork and divorce? Why would you want to work for that ghost bureaucracy? This is the inch this is like the most random but interesting like meta that I've seen playing this game. I mean there could be theoretically be death beyond death. There could, I guess. That's like Death Beyond Death, what would that be though? Maybe one ghost haunts people by creating as much red tape as possible. No, people do that to themselves. One second, because this is the most esoteric fucking discussion. I have not seen Coco. And I think tomorrow we'll just uh, keep going with dates and then switch games. Unless we do Far Cry. Excuse me. I don't know, Sam. Um... That, that's interesting. Katchen, you have to send this to the group text. Because this is the most, like, esoteric fucking discussion I think I've had in this chat in a while. Right? Nothing? This poor fucking ghost. Oh shit. Well, I wouldn't last very long. I don't know if I could watch that if that's what happens. Oh. See, look at this. Look at this face. Dang it. I don't know. Like, I have. I'm. Well, I don't want to die. I'm phobic about dying. Um. But I have issues around death. And I don't know if I could watch that and be okay. Like, I r literally don't know if I could watch that and be okay. Mm -hmm. 
That's legit nothing. Oh my god, Jesse. Oh, I'm sure, Violet. But, like, Mano Moana got to me, and I'm not even Maori or Hawaiian. It was just like, everything I've heard about Coco tells me it's amazing, but it will mess me up. Yeah, no. Unless y'all really want me to be fucked up. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sure, Violet. And I'm really happy. As my own issues with death will make it hard for me to watch it. I mean, I and I do like De, La, De Los Muertos. And I've gone to exhibits and things like that, but a movie is so interactive and visceral, I know it would get to me. I know. No, no, you didn't, Violet. And I'm not wording well because I'm tired. Um, I've been up since like 6 a.m. Uh, Eastern time, which is 6 for me, which is normal. But I also traveled. So my brain's like, no more. We're done. It was fine. It was a short flight for me to come back from Boston. Um, it was more that I paid to upgrade my seat, but then I was in that row that's right behind first class. So while I had more leg room, I was in a middle seat. Oh, who followed? I didn't even see it. Oh, thanks for the uh, follow, David Song. Weird, the uh, bot didn't pop up. Thank you. Follow hype. Hey, David, how are you? Well, uh, we're trying to romance some ghosts. Nightbot is on, but it's actually Streamlabs spot that should announce the follow. I wonder like what what it's up to. Nightbot is always running because it's web based. Yeah, the music production is really really good on it. Um, Like the ambient noises, the music per scene. Yeah, if you do pick up the game, please let Copy Chaser Games know. Um, 
because it's fun. I'm really, I'm really enjoying the game because I'm not a big dating, a, not a big dating game person. Um, the Catchin, if Catchin's still in the chat, knows Dream Daddy was my first uh, dating sim that I ever played. Um, why, why is this ghost still trying to get me to rob a bank? This is my question. Hey, Ona, thank you for the auto host. It is on Steam, actually. If you do exclamation at B O O S, um, you will get the link to itch and to Steam. Oh, Trom, Trom. Oh my god. I see what you did there. I see. Hey Ming, how are you? What's cool, Catchin? Oh, I think the green screen is being weird because there's green in the shirt. How are you, Ming? Can I get a shout out for Ming as well? Trom, since you are a mod, just exclamation shout out and Ming's name. Um, I am okay. I am, uh, back from PAX. And did a little catch up IRL. And now we're trying to get this ghost, get this ghost loving. And uh, then we're gonna call it a night cause I'm sleepy. But after we find someone to uh, play, oh, you're always welcome. Um, you're welcome, Trom. Excuse me. That was unattractive and rude. And actually, it wasn't done. Um, it was good. I mean, so so we keep talking about packs. Um, the question is, would you go to packs for buying things, to go to panels, to walk the show floor? Because there's a lot of stuff about um, packs where I'm like, you're standing in line to buy stuff. Why don't you just buy it online? Like, I'm that being that person when I go to cons. And like, why are you standing in line for hours to buy a thing? And what are you going to do with the thing once you get it home? Or standing in line to play a game that will be out in like a week? I mean, honestly, I would go to panels and do parties if that's what you wanted. Um, go to the show floor early. Get out of the way. What's a Guardian Con? Yeah, that that's legit nothing. Cause Sam, have you been to like GDC and PAX Dev and stuff? That's just a lot of money to go see people. But it's also like, if this is the only spot everyone's going to be in, I can get it. Mm. But, and it's hard for me because I go to conventions to work. I'm either on panels, I Need Diverse Games has a presence. Um, I don't go to cons anymore just for fun. Okay. Oh, you know what? I've heard of it. I've heard of it. I just realized that. I saw people with Guardian Con shirts when I was at TwitchCon. Fran doesn't believe you. Um, Fran stares at Leon. Nick! Uh, I don't know about Momocon. When is it? I'm 
watching you. What did I do? Right? Hey, Melvin. How's food? Uh, that is the same weekend as, uh, Wiscon. Nick. Um, there is something in Minnesota. There's actually a couple things in Minnesota. Um... I know there's a con my friends go to, and they mostly go because they live there. <sighs> Fuck, what is it? Is it Convergence in Minnesota? Convergence is somewhere. Is it Michigan, Minnesota? It's an eight-hour drive from Chicago. Look up Convergence. That may be in Minnesota or Michigan. I'm like there is there's stuff in Minnesota. I'm just trying to remember. Yeah, well, you're in luck for Pittsburgh because um Pax Unplugged is there and it I think dates may already be decided for this year. Um, Wiscon, well, Con or Bust and Wiscon does have a fund to help people, um, depending on if you're a marginalized person or not. Um, um, I guess it depends on Wizcon what it would be that you want out of it. Sorry. Oh, okay, Akimba. Then uh, you should look into PAX Unplugged. If tabletop is your thing, uh, tabletop and board games are PAX Unplugged. There's always been a growing presence of board games on at regular PAX. But last year was the first one that they decided to do just board games. Is it? Oh, okay. Oh no, I feel you. Well, I'm saying if if it is something that you might want to do and money is kind of an issue or it could be an issue, uh, con or bust, which I actually set on the board on, um, so set on the board of, and WizCon itself has a fund to help people get to the con. Um, are we turning him down, turning him in, or helping him out? Um. Alright, night pseudo. I'm gonna do this, then I'm gonna call it, because I am, I am a tired muffin. Um, I'm gonna turn him in. Good night. <clears throat> um, you know what, Ming? Just stay to yourself. Keep hand sanitizer on you at all times. Um, Matsudo, thanks for hanging out. Um, well, you'll never know because uh, Leon left. 
right, and that's where we're going to end it. Um, I'm getting a little tired. Um, yeah, I know. I think it's because my shirt. Because there's a lot of green on the I Need Diverse Game shirt. And also, I think a light went out while I was gone. Um, but let's see who's on while I roll credits. And, uh... No problem, Jared. I'll be on tomorrow. I normally don't stream on Mondays. Um... But I felt like doing it today when I got back. Um, where is credits? Okay, they took away the new thing. So that's why I was like, what's going on? So I'm going to roll credits while I look for someone to host. And I'm just going to keep the mic going. Night, Jared. Uh, well, don't leave yet. I'm going to find someone to host. And then we can, uh, call it a night after I roll credits. I'm just saying who's on. Uh, Mira's on. Texas Cub SF is on. Erica Ishii's on. Dylan's on. Oh shit, he's playing, uh, uh, Bayek. He's playing Assassin's Creed Origins. And he's got, a. Uh, He's got Tal Bayek going. I think we have a winner. Uh, are the credits not rolling? Or they go past already? Are they just slow? Yes, Tal Bayek. Good night, everyone. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, okay, there we go. It was a little weird. Um... So we're going to raid 8-Bit Dylan, who is playing Assassin's Creed Origins. So let's give Dylan a raid to see what he's up to, and then I'm going to go the fuck to sleep. So thanks everybody for hanging out tonight, uh, for the extra stream both talk show and the um and some uh, ghostly lovin i will catch all of you tomorrow Just about to end. Can you call me right at the end of my stream? Um, and I think the game auto saves, I believe. I think. I could be wrong about that. Uh, yeah. I, I think it auto saves. Uh, Cypher! Yes! Uh, we can both raid someone. Let's both trade. We can, we can work together on this, girl. Let's raid. Give me a second. Da -da 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 -da. Um, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Yo, I don't know who. There's, There's so many people in the LGBT tag, it makes me so happy. happy.